Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. This is Geeta. So what day of the week was 26th Jan 1950. So we are going to use the code method to figure this out. So the code goes as follows. So the date will take will be taking as it is same number whatever it is the date given and for day the code is we go in this order start from Sunday Monday Tuesday and it goes like 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 or 0. I'll tell you how to apply this at the end of this question. So, and for month, it is Jan, Feb, March and go on. So, it goes like 12 square, 144, 5 square, which is 0, 2, 5, 6 square, which is 0, 3, 6 and 144 plus 2. So, it is 146. This is the code for the month and code for the year goes like this. So it's starting from 1600, 1700, 1800, 1900, 2000, 2100, 2200, 2300. So let's start the 2 times table. 2 times 0 is 0, 2 times 1 is 2, 2 times 2 is 4, 2 times 3 is 6. So same thing here, yes, 6, 4, 2 and 0. So we're just going to apply everything in the code and we'll just get the answer. So it goes like this. So 26, so date as it is, so it is 26. Jan, the code for Jan is 1. So let's take it as 0, 1. So for easy calculation. And 1950, so 1950 comes here. So it is 0. And then write this 50 as it is. And then divide this 50 by 4 and write the quotient. So the quotient is 4 times 1 is 4. There is a difference of 1. So adding that 1 here. So 4 times 2 is 8. There is a 9. Difference remainder is 2. We don't want the remainder here. We are just taking the quotient. So quotient here is 12. So write the 12. So add all of them. So which is 6 plus 1 is 7 plus 2 is a 9. 5 plus 1 is 6. 6 plus 2 is 8. Now divide this by 7. So we can just remember as we are dividing by 7 because there are 7 days a week. So 7 times 1 is 7. There is a difference of 1. Bring this 9 down. So 7 times 2 is 14. So there is a difference of 5. So this is what we need. So the reminder. Reminder is equals 5. So we have to look for the code for 5. So it is Thursday. Therefore, what day of the week was 26 Jan 1950 was Thursday. Thanks for watching. If you have any doubts, please let me know in the comments.